I mean, Sunday was one of those funny ones in that it, it looked like quite a good game, and then the, it was one of those where the sending off definitely changed things, didn't it? Yeah, I think um, before the sending off, personally, I thought we were we were the better side. Um, I thought, you know, if we if we had the the eleven men, I th think we would have went on to to win that game. Um, but you know, these things happen, and you know, he's got sent off. I don't know whether it is a sending off or not. Um, but it's the rest of the decision, and you know, he sent him off, and you know, we've lost the game. So you know, we need to put put things right, and you know, we need to start start that tomorrow. Yeah, and and that's a couple of red cards in the last three matches, and, and that's something. And neither of them particularly bad fouls or anything. But you, you just got to be careful of this because it, it doesn't half make life difficult, does it? Playing with ten. Yeah, that's it. It, was, it it did change the game um, as soon as we got the the sending off. You know, they scored straight away from the, from the free kick, and you know, it made our lives. You know. More harder, and you know it, it. It gave them the the momentum, and you know they went on to comfortably win the game in the end. Um, you know we we did have a another spell in the second half where we had a few chances, um, but you know it, it weren't to be, and you know we got to move on from this. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And and I think there are some players that are playing well at the moment. The managers picked out and said that he thinks some are f sort of fighting against their form. Is it is it difficult when you're in that kind of, um, of mood, not that you're in bad form, but when you're just trying to find yourself and trying to get back to the way you know you can play? Yeah, we, we, we all know that we're a, we're a good side and we've got, um, we've got good players at the club and, you know, we're, for me, we're underachieving at the minute. Um, but, you know, like the gaff, like the gaff is saying, we're, we're good in patches and, you know, we need to, to be more consistent in games. Uh, we can't just be be good in 20 minute spells and, and stuff like that we need to do that for for the old 90 minutes um, once that comes then I'm sure we're um, we'll do well and we'll, we'll win a lot more games but you know with with tomorrow's game it's, it's, a, it's a I know it's a cup game but um, it, it gives us a chance to to get that winning feeling again um, you know we've had a couple of bad results and we need to to get back on our game and put in a good performance because frankly nobody's going to expect a great deal of you there. You're up against a team that's in fantastic form and has spent a lot of money. Does, does that make it easier? Does it make any difference the way you approach it? No, I don't think we're approaching it any differently. Um, you know, we, we know that they probably have a lot, a lot, a lot of the ball like like Fulham did. Um, but you know, against Fulham, you know, we kept the clean sheet and we were, we were defensively solid. And I think sometimes we we got to do that, and we probably got to do that more, more in the league than than not. Um, you know, it sh shows that we are, we can keep a clean sheet uh, against the top side, and you know we're we're, we're going to the same mentality uh, tom in tomorrow's game. Um, they'll obviously be a good side, they're a, a good championship side, so um, we have to be on our game. But hopefully, we can do the same as we did at Fulham. Yeah, and, and much as that match, I mean, they've spent a lot of money. They're expected to be one of the top teams in the championship. They're up there at the moment. Um, you know, they're a good attacking force. You're going to have to improve defensively, otherwise, you will be in a bit of trouble. Yeah, we've conceded a lot of goals um, this season. It's you know, it's, it's definitely something we need to work on. Um, it's definitely not just the defenders' fault. It's not just because we're conceding goals. Not down to the keeper and and defend defenders. It's you know, it's everyone in the whole team. Um, we need to always we need to do our our jobs right. Um, and you know, we need to definitely keep more clean sheets and stop conceding. You know, we get we're getting a bit sloppy. We we conceded a lot of goals at. Um, set pieces and you know it's not it's not always the same man so uh, we do need to tighten up uh, defensively and you know that will give us more of a chance to, to go on and win games. And, and obviously you enjoyed the trip to Craven Cottage more you another big ground hopefully there'll be a decent sized crowd in there D does that give you a little extra buzz going into a match like this? I think it's a good time for us to, to play this game after um, a couple bad results um, you know it, it, there's no, no points on it but you know we want to we want to have a cup run um, and like I said before, it, it, it gives us that um, winning feeling again, and it can it can change our change our form in the league. So you know, if we can go go to Molyneux and get a, a positive result, then you know we can take that into to the Blackpool game.